Opposition leader Kamala Prasad Vissessa described Finance Minister Colin Burt's presentation of the national budget as a masterpiece of misery and a summary of a decade of destruction. She commented immediately after the budget presentation during a press conference. Candice Jackson has the details. Opposition leader Kamala Prasad Sasa stated that the fiscal 2025 budget presentation is merely a repetition of past promises and an attempt at election campaigning, while Finance Minister Kam Imbert argued that the economy has seen some growth. She claimed he was overlooking other economic issues that paint a different picture. The economic indicators are in steadfast decline since 2015 because of the resolute incompetence Mentioned, the minister mentioned no pathways to long-term prosperity besides waiting for gas production and prices to rebound. Nine years and nothing. Now going into the 10th year. She added that the economic growth mentioned does not indicate that the economy is back to performing at its best. Minister has not mentioned when he's talking about the country growing and everything is booming and growth that this economy is 20% smaller today than it was when we left government in 2015. In his presentation, Imbert boasted that the country has a healthy heritage and stabilization fund with U.S. $5.4 billion in its reserves. However, Passad Bissessa argued that he should be ashamed as the fund was valued at over U.S. $10 billion in 2015. If that not bad enough, we see today from this budget that Forex reserves will continue to fall over the near future unless and until Major gas production come in online in when projected 2027. Pasabi Sasa claimed that the minister offered no clear direction for economic diversification, instead relying on projected gains of the drug and gas deal in 2027 as the economy's savior. Meanwhile, one of the announcements facing criticism was the purchase of new Coast Guard vessels. They have 30 boats right now doing what? Parked up. What are you going to buy? Four new patrol boats, eight high-speed interceptors. What are they going to cost when you have 30 boats sitting on there parked up for repairs and they are not fixing them? They're not repairing them at all. Passat Vicesa plans to address these issues and more in detail when she kicks off the budget debate on Friday. Candace Jackson, Tobago Updates, Television News.